special Sony's Piano Video Tour for you today. This we have nicknamed the Green Chi Steinway. Of course, this is a Steinway Model M. And the reason why we have called it the Green Chi Steinway is because Chi is a Chinese term for the life force energy that's within us all and that makes up the universe. And this piano is a unique work of art. It's a chinoiserie style of art, hand-painted Steinway piano. Chinoiserie painting started in the 16th century in China and then it came to Europe and in particular France and its nature scenes and its Chinese style landscape painting. The reason why we have called this the Green Chi Steinway is because all of the scenes on here represent rejuvenation, relaxation. These are landscape scenes and it represents mountains which actually symbolize the uh, chi, the life force. And it has flowers and it has trees and it has water and it has music and it has dancers and it has birds and it has butterflies. Everywhere you look, it's a beautiful work of art. Right here, you could just take this and frame it, put it up on your wall, beautiful. Right here, beautiful. We got this piano about a year ago and it didn't look like this. It was really uh, in distress. You could barely make out the paintings. The piano needed to be rebuilt and we rebuilt it with a uh, new pin block, new pins, new strings, new Steinway action. And the original, uh, very excellent condition, Steinway soundboard. And it just sounds beautiful. It has beautiful original ivory keys. So it's a magnificent instrument. And this piano was originally made in 1918. Soon after, it appears several artists created this beautiful work of art on here. The paintings are various shades of gold and red and browns and greens. Another very special aspect of these paintings is that many of them are embossed. It's not just flat paintings on the piano, they're embossed, they're raised, and the embossing gives it a three-dimensional effect so that when you're looking at it, it's almost like you're looking into the piano. It's like really a sense of depth. It's just quite an experience. It's almost interdimensional. This is something that you might see in the emperor's palatial grounds. These are all gardens and they all interconnect. There's like a bridge that connects each of the landscape scenes. There are pagodas on here. There are people, as I said, fishing and playing instruments. And it's just a sight to behold. And we're very fortunate to have it here. So again, the reason why we're calling it the Green Chi Steinway is because this Steinway is just designed everywhere you look to restore you, to rejuvenate you, to relax you, to revitalize you. And it's a beautiful instrument and pianos restore you and revitalize you and rejuvenate you. Just playing the piano will relax you, release beta endorphins in your brain and, and dopamine and give you a sense of well-being just playing it. And paintings and artwork do the same thing. When you look at a beautiful painting, it, it, you just feel good. And why do you feel good? Because somehow the, 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 the viewing of the artwork re releases dopamine and beta endorphins in your brain. So this piano, this piano is like a meditation piano. You just sit here, you play, and you just breathe, and meditation will come upon you. And it's just a beautiful, beautiful thing. Beautiful, moving. And what I was playing there was just spontaneous improvisation on the black notes, just flowing along. Actually, uh, in my piano yoga uh, DVD and my piano yoga method, 
That's the first lesson I show people. It's called the Black Note Flow Lesson. You just flow along on the black notes. You know, this is something really, really special, really magical. And as I said, everywhere you look, here on the front floorboard, we have a dancer and a musician, and we have some pagodas, and we have these flowers, and uh, on here are very unique and interesting rocks. And the rocks represent the chi, and the rocks represent the mountains. So this is a kind of place that you would go if uh, you wanted to be restored back in the uh, 16th century and the 1500s in, in China. You would go to this beautiful nature preserve, so to speak, and uh, just as you do today when you go to a nature preserve, you go there to be, get away from it all, to relax, to revitalize. And, and so it is with this piano. Not only playing it gives you a, a natural a, a high and a natural sense of well-being, but also just viewing it and looking at it will give you that sense of well-being. So on the foreboard we have all of that. Then on the back of the foreboard we have birds and we have trees. Let me not forget a very important point here. We had this piano restored by a master of chinoiserie art here in New York City. His name is Nam Tai. And over a period of nine months, he very painstakingly cleaned the piano and brought out the natural green color. And then went over this and it, it just took an enormous amount of time and energy. And he's just an incredible artist. And each, each line, each leaf, each rock, each bird, he just restored this to better than its uh, original look. So here we have all of this. We have the pagodas up here. We have swans. It's just, every time I look at this, I see more things. On the side of the piano, you have a series of landscape, natural scenes, and they run from one to the other. They're connected by bridges, and they have all this beautiful, beautiful, beautiful artwork. On the straight side, it's just beautiful. This isn't just one painting. This is a constant flow of paintings. On the uh, front half of the lid, you have all this beautiful, beautiful artwork. And when you open the lid, it's just incredible. We have a hunter about to hunt, uh, shoot at a bird. And underneath the lid, now that's very uh, unique. You don't really see on any painted pianos or very few of them that they do a whole beautiful scene on the under part of the lid. But on this piano, they did that. So it's just remarkable. It's just, I feel healed and, and refreshed by playing this piano. And just sitting here just gives me a sense of well-being. So we have this here at Sony's Pianos. And as I said, we bought it over a year ago. It took at least nine, 10 months to restore this. And this is just something that's remarkable. Just simply remarkable. And if you want to come down and just look at it, we already have media coverage on this. If you're a member of the media, you want to come down and do a story on this. This is a unique, one-of-a-kind piano. Just give us a call, make an appointment. And if you want to come down and play it, once again, give us a call, make an appointment. We're here on Long Island in New York, in the middle of the island. It's called Bohemia. We're right across the street from an airport, the Islip Airport. We're near the Long Island Railroad, Ronkonkoma train station. So you want to come out from New York City or you want to fly in to LaGuardia or Kennedy. They're only about an hour away. But this is just something stupendous. This is something very, very rare, very, very unique, and very, very special. Listen to the mid-range on this piano. We've had high-end musicians come in here already, play all our Steinways, and they gravitate to this one.
close, we can put our new MAPES bass strings on here. heavenly feeling. So, once again, what do we have here? We have a one-of-a-kind, unique, original, hand-painted, chinoiserie-style landscape scene work of art and a 1918 Steinway Model M. Totally restored. Just finished it this past month and it is waiting or it's calling out. It's sending out its energy and its chi, the green chi. The, the Indian word for it is prana. Uh, here in uh, the West, uh, Wilhelm Reich called it orgone energy, orgone energy, the life force energy, the energy that we are made up of and that the whole universe is made up of, very healing. The green chi, Steinway. Only at Sonny's Piano. Thank you for watching and allowing us to share these pianos with you. The Green Chi Steinway.